सो हियर आई हैव ए क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम कुमार तन्मय तन्मय चौबे फ्रॉम क्लास टेंथ एंड द क्वेश्चन इज दैट सर आई हैव ए क्वेश्चन दैट वाई स्काई अपियर्स ब्लू आई हैव स्टडीड दैट लाइट हैविंग लेस वेव लेंथ इज स्कैटर्ड मोर सो अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस वायलेट और इंडिगो शुड बी सीन बिकॉज दे स्कैटर मोर देन द ब्लू दैट इज अ वेरी वैलिड क्वेश्चन वी ऑलवेज put these things in our textbooks and lectures that because of that uh, smaller wavelength uh, scatters more therefore red doesn't scatter much but blue it scatters uh, much more and therefore we see this blue light in the sky but uh, while it has even smaller wavelength but the problem is that uh, all these colors do not have same intensity in the sunlight if you see the intensity distribution then it peaks at green so green has a maximum intensity if you see the sunlight and the green component of the white light from the sun has maximum intensity and then intensity lowers on both sides and if you reach the violet since it is at the edge of the visible okay so so that intensity is uh, much lower and therefore you don't see much of violet if violet scatters blue also scatters and since blue intensity is more than violet it uh, finally appears to the eye as blue it is also to be realized that when we look at the sky and we receive this uh, scattered light it's a, it's a range violet blue green to some extent yellow everything scatters in different proportions the intensity distribution is different and then the scattering probabilities are different one by lambda 4 or so so we are receiving green blue violet indigo everything but in different proportions and that mixing gives me a different colors just as seven colors in a particular proportion mixed gives us impression of white similarly this scattered light is also having a mixture of so many wavelengths and therefore uh, it will also give some kind of a, an appearance so that is also important and then uh, when we say visible light is from 400 nanometer to 700 nanometer uh, is there no radiation uh, of wavelength more than 700 is very much there a lot of infrared in in the sun our eyes are not sensitive so these things are also important how do we see what is the mechanism of eye why we don't see say 380 or 370 nanometer or, or 780 in nanometers so that sensitivity of eyes for different wavelengths the presence of different wavelengths that finally gives us a in appearance